So can you guys guess at least one of the books that are in this pile? If you want to guess, comment them down below and we will see if you got it right. So continue on with the video to see if you got it right. Hello everyone, I'm Colleen and today I'm going to be showing you guys my April TBR. First book that I want to finish in April is The Final Empire by Brandon Sanderson. I was meant to finish this back in March for my challenge which was to read a book over 500 pages for my TBR jar challenge and I never got to do that but right now I am on page 346 and so far so good I'm definitely enjoying this world and this whole magic system and I'm hoping that I will finish this book because I am enjoying it my TBR jar challenge for April is to read a 2015 debut novel and I am hoping to read Vendetta by Catherine Doyle. I have heard a lot of great things about this. I don't even think I've heard a bad thing about this yet. But look at the end page and I know that this book is like a modern version of Romeo and Juliet so it's going to be really interesting. I have two books I'm prioritizing this month and one of them is going to be Weightless by Sarah Brennan. This is also a 2015 debut novel I believe. This was released in March and um, I know that this is a contemporary. I have already started it. I am on page 96 and I am not exactly liking it but I'm also not hating it. And the other book that I'm prioritizing is Only Ever Yours by Louise O'Neill and I know that this is set in a dystopian world and that's all I really know but I like the cover and the reason why I'm prioritizing these two books is because the two authors are going to be having a book signing and I am hoping to go there so I can get my book signed. I have joined a good amount of book clubs on Goodreads and I have never participated in one but I have joined a new book club which is Wizarding Books. I will link the link below and the book that they are going to be reading this month is Daughter Smoke and Bone by Lainey Taylor. I have been wanting to read this book for a very long time and I just heard that this book is set in a really complex world with a lot of terminology so I want to read this book when I have enough time and when I'm actually in the mood and right now I am in the mood for fantasy so I can't wait to read this and this isn't exactly my my priority so once I finish the books that I have already showed you I am definitely going to be jumping right into this. So yeah these are all the books I'm hoping to read in April. I do feel a little bit ambitious but you know what I am up for the challenge. I hopefully will be able to finish these. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys like this video. Make sure to like, comment, and whatever you want, and I will see you in my next one. Bye!